Hey everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Dad Games Badly. We are back here today with our 48 team uh, custom expansion franchise draft. Uh, we are heading into the off season after an all right, um, basically uh, draft. It wasn't that great. Our season wasn't great. We we're an okay team, but we weren't good enough. Uh, with only 16 teams out of the 48 teams making it through. So we do need to worry about this kind of stuff. Um, probably going to keep... Well, no, we don't have a lot of vets on our team, really. So we're just going to let everybody here go. We'll keep the people that we do have, because the AHL team did make it to the, the playoffs, at least. Um, we did not, so let's head into resign phase. I don't think we've got a lot of people to resign. Um, yes, thank you, thank you. Go ahead and look at centers. Uh, not going to bring Bozak back. Uh, how good was Letary for us last year? Uh, seven points in eighteen games, minus five. Not good enough. So both Bozy and Letary will go. Uh, you know, Light. we've got at least two centers. We do need to. Build around that. Uh, Genther, Nick Felino's gonna go. Paul Byron's gonna go. Subscribe. Neither were all too that good for us. Uh, Hathaway. I mean, not terrible. I don't. What is he looking for? 2.75. He does want to come back. Let's see if I can get a little bit off of that here. Uh, Calculator, 85% trick. Uh, it's not a lot. But if he takes it, that's a win. Uh, defensively, Bockwest. Owen Power. Uh, Brant Clark. We're keeping Gudis. I mean, honestly, Gudis was fantastic. Well, not really. So we'll get rid of him. Cody Franson didn't play with us last year, but in the AHL he did alright. Uh, I don't think he is the guy though, so we're gonna get rid of him. Matty Irwin's gone. And then goal. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's see. Honestly, I think we sign Shalan. And have her back up, Grubauer. How many more years do we have of Gruby? Four more years. Oh my. Alright, well. That's okay. Entry level. Kudobin is going to be gone. And we'll bring in Rodrigue. We'll, what is he looking for in a contract? Not much, so we'll just sign him to that. And we'll advance a day. So Hathaway does want to come back, but he wants the money. Uh, let's see if I can get him down to at least 2.5. Perfect. He got a little bit more money. We are good on that. Paul Leg needs to play more than four games. But at that overall, he's not going to make it on this team. Alright, so we need to go in to look at scouting. I don't know exactly how many scouts we have. Okay, so they're all still here. Probably a good shout to get rid of Wolf. Kovalev, and then we'll see where we're at. We'll keep celebrated scouts until we know what we're getting into. Um, everybody we want to sign is signed. I don't think we have anybody we need to worry about. Alright, let's just go ahead and get up to the draft. So I'm double check here. All expiring, nobody, UFA, 
RFA, perfect. I guess I could just do the free agency, but we'll just do it this way. Hope everybody's doing well today. Uh, started snowing here last night. Um, it was great. I was outside having a smoke, and it was all just coming down on my head. Uh, it was fantastic. Love living in Canada. No, I actually do. I much prefer this kind of weather. Any other time, I feel like I would just be fucking dead. Just dead. I Like, once it gets over, like, 20 degrees, I'm done. I am done. Alright, let's go ahead and see who is available. Yeah, see, there's not really much available to us right now. Um, let's go ahead and find the players with the best prospect discovery. It is going to be somebody like this. Efficiency, we want this guy is a little bit better. Kurt De Silva, we'll give you a couple extra thousand dollars. And then uh, from there, kind of. And this guy might be able to get us a little bit more in the X Factor category, Sergey Berlin. So, Sergey, come on down. Uh, we need to go into coaches from here. I need all coaches. Um, I mean, the defensive coach wouldn't be a terrible shout because I do have um, Owen Power and Boquest. So let's give JC Madsen all the money and snag him for ourselves. Uh, and then we'll look in for like a generalist or a forward coach. Kind of from there. Because honestly, this is where our skill lies, right? Is in this end. Come on, JC. I wish this would go faster. I could type it in because then I could just say 82 or 8.2 mil. I think if I give him at least 2 million more, he should be fine. Uh, there we go. I don't mean to move the years on you because I don't like that. I found coaches and scouts don't like if you move the years around. Uh, a generalist and a forward. So you are a def You're forty percent with this group. That's okay. This guy is also forty percent with this group. Lemieux. Forty seven. Mangon is forty five. Was it Mangon? No, it was this guy. Alright, we're gonna go with Lemieux. That's our associate. Just throw him more money. His career record is 49, 27, and 6. Which isn't like fantastic it's a winning record, but it's not like he's played one had one season as a head coach. And you were let go? Interesting. I wonder who they were looking for. Alright, Pascal, let's give you the money. I'm going to stop soon, right about now. Offer that contract to you. And then I want Murray coming in. Also has a winning record, but not fantastic. So JC, you're not quite ready for the role yet. We're going to take a look for four years and see where you're at and make a decision. Uh, you might move you around. You might even be the head coach. You never know. You never, ever, ever know. Um, depending on how your chemistry is with the players, we'll go from there. So nobody else is really interested in JC, but we'll still make sure that we give them quite a bit more money. Offer him that contract. And then we'll worry about goalie coach a little bit. Alright. So we have a ton of money to spend. I believe. Uh, yeah, we have $63 million to spend. Uh, Patrick Kane's available. Tarasenko... All right, so we have our top two centers. And 
I think that's it. Like, we don't really have much in the way of wingers. So I wouldn't say no to going after Kaner, but that is a lot of money. So if we go after Kane, we are really making a push. Um, Tarasenko, though, not that, like, I guess he's younger, not by three years, but that 95 to 89 is ridiculous. Uh, Ryan O'Reilly, Brandstrom. All right, I got to go both back and look at my roster and just kind of see what my makeup is and where I need to put people. Um, so let's go take a quick look. View those contracts. All right, so center-wise, I've got my top two, basically. That's kind of who I'm going to run. Yeah. And then left wing, I've got Genther. Genther is a sniper. Veneers is a 2A. Okay. And then on the right wing, I've got Hathaway. And then on defense, I've got Bockwist, Power, 1-2. Six. Okay. I kind of know what I'm looking for then. All right, free agents, come on down. So I think having Tarasenko would be the bad shout, being he is a sniper. Maddie Kane is a sniper too. Are you serious? Really, Patrick Kane, sniper. I mean. Pavelski are my first line guys. Pavelski's also a two way. Bottom six. Doesn't fit. Sorry, considering him our coach. That's Murray guy. So Gustav Nyquist fits in with his scheming. Oh my god, no. Alright, we're going to make an offer. He only wants one year. If I want him, i got to give him a little bit more. I know it's a little ridiculous, but I want him. Okay. And then left wing, we're good. We need... Another right wing for the second line. This one I'm thinking more of... I mean, Nyquist is a little more expensive than I'd like to spend. Where does Kessel fit in with this guy? He doesn't know. Donskoy. I don't hate Akposa, actually. Just give him that little bit extra. Alright, so left wingers, I need one for my top six. I mean... No offense, we're gonna be in 84. At this stage is a little silly. Um... Let's go with the bunting. What do you think of that? A six year deal? Yeah. For five year. What if I give you a four year don't bunts? For five mil. All right, so that's that, and then centers. I mean, I need middle pairing defense defensemen. I mean, you're an RFA, Bernstein. They're both okay. So I'd be looking at like Dumba, Ghost Bear. Wait, 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 I'm sorry. I, I just got to double check something. Matt Dumba. It's from Regina. Okay. I thought it was from Alaska, and I was going to like, okay, he has to go to Alaska. But Regina's not interested, so six years. Fuck. Uh, 
Ghost Bear, Sandheim. Sandheim is younger. Let's make a play. All right. These are the guys that I'm going for to fill out that line. And then we'll kind of go from there if we don't get anybody. All right. Got to make my play. See what happens. JC Madsen comes in. Loves it. Pascal Lemieux went with another team. He did not. Okay, I'm very confused with that. All right. So did I get him as my coach or what? So I got this guy. We'll just go back into it here. You didn't go anywhere, Lemieux, you bum. <laughs> oh, I really don't want to have to see this screen again until a little bit later. Uh, just because of that, Pascal, I'm offering you less money. You're only getting a million more. Than you're asking. Okay, that's that. I'm still waiting <gasps> on those scouts. Yes, I did pick some scouts, remember? There we go. Breelin. De Silva. Beautiful. Lemieux does go with Boston this time. The bum. Bunting joins. Akpozo. Alright, so I didn't get that coach. Uh, who was the other one that was there? Hayes. Not as good. <sighs> Offer him the money. <laughs> Buffalo wants him. I mean, I gotta give more money, so that's really the only way. He's not really that great. He won't be my head coach, though, so that's fine. I'm going to take Luongo. Alright, come on, Adrian Luongo. I'll just offer you all the money. I don't want this guy. He's 54, does not look it. Let's off from the associate coach role and continue on with the Patty Kane sweepstakes. We are going to find out soon enough. Matt Dumba comes, Patrick Kane comes, Sandheim comes. Love it. Alright, let's take a look at these contracts and kind of see where we're at money wise. Uh, we have $25 million left for everybody else. Our centers are Veneers and Holloway. Our left wingers are Genther and Bunting. Our right wingers are Kane and Akpozo. Garnet Hathaway is in number three spot. Defensively, one, two, three, four. Uh, obviously, Bauer is going to be moving up uh, and continuing on with his very strong rookie season. 39 points. We'll see, actually, but hey. Um, we'll see how that goes. So then, center-wise, I need two more centers. I need two more wingers and one more right-winger. Defensively, I need one or two more players, probably a lefty. I need a left defenseman and goaltending, I'm fine. And then it's just finding everybody else, which I should have probably done early and seen if there were any prospects that I could have got. But hey, that's kind of the way she goes. Not too worried about that right now. So, two A centers Young Iconin, McBain, Schnarr.
All right, McBain. Give Schnarr and Slab money. Left wingers. Uh, Santa's Phil Manis. I'm going to take him. Nobody else is offering him anything. I know he's he's 19 though, and that's kind of what I'm looking at. Neiman as well. Offer you a three-year deal. Uh, right wing. Just seeing if there's anybody worthwhile. This guy. Offer you that deal. Probably take these two 19 year olds as well. Defensively, same kind of thought process. You're 25, Nason. Sorry, buddy. Uh, Rassinen, yikes. I mean, there's 48 teams, right? So it's going to be very hard. Uh, I'm going to bring No Warren in. Christian Cairo can come. We'll take these two 19 year olds as well. I mean, we're just going to have a lot of really just young guys. Uh, 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 and then that's really it. So back up to centers. So none of those guys will actually count towards anything, so that's fine. All right. <clears throat> not looking into Cody Glass. Not for three million and a seventy-nine at twenty-four. That's for sure. Um, well, it is sl not slim pickings, but definitely not good. Uh, Max Domi, you want too much? Sam Gagne. I don't hate that. Or have the room for you. And then for fourth line, I'd be looking for someone closer to the, the likes of like one of these two. Probably Luke Glendening if he's only asking for that much. Perfect. Left wingers. I need two more. I don't want to bring Parise back. Or JVR. Uh, Taylor Janot wants way too much money. I mean, actually, in all honesty. There's one other team interested in him. So I have to give a little bit more. Hmm. Oh, I did not read that. But I, he's offer sheeted at 26? Really? He's an RFA. Oh, whatever. Hopefully we don't get him. Uh, and then a fourth line guy. I'm looking more towards the likes of a, a Belmar, maybe. Isaac Ratcliffe. Are you an RFA? Yeah, you are. I'm going to do Gabe Forche. Dude. Yeah? I mean, you can still get better, so I don't know why I wouldn't do that. Uh, right wing, I need somebody like a uh, Sammy Blay, Jesper Fast. How much money are you posted before? Uh, Sammy was good, yes. Love how they haven't fixed that yet. Yeah. Uh, definitely going after Sammy here. Nobody else is interested, but I'm going to give him a little bit more money. And then, like, a lefty is what I'm looking for. Fucky and Cole. Even if it's not true. Just the fact that somebody feels that way about you is uh, a little worrisome. Uh, 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 Dermot, you want too much money, bud. Uh, TVR, same thing. 
Charis back out there. He wants way too much money, but he's so good. Alright. Nobody's offering Char any money. Honestly, if we bring him back until he's 48. Alright. <clears throat> see how things go here in the next few days. Franklin Hayes comes. Luongo joins. Perfect. We've got our coaches. I do need to find... I'd like to find a good goalie coach if we can. Because we have a decent goalie. Teaching A+. Plus. in the red on my coach budget. That's okay. Cooper Keatley. So, who has the best chemistry? Uh, you can't tell right now. He's terrible with all my defensive guys, and he's a defenseman. But Matty Beniers and Dylan Holloway and Minty who won't even be on this roster, most likely. Uh, all right, let's advance more a couple days. Cooper Keatley comes in, beautiful. Joel Janssen accepts her offer. Neiman, Noah Warren, Santos Vilmanis, Jake Furlong. Tanner Janot does go to Moscow, which is fine. I didn't really want to pay him that much money. Langlois, Kairou, Gavin Hayes. Let's go another day. Nate Schnarr, Luke Lindenning, Gabe Fortier, Riley Sutter, Jack McBain, Sammy Chara is back. Gagne goes to Columbus. We'll go one more day. And then we'll go take a look at our contracts again and see what we need. So, in centers, I need one more. Left wingers, I need one more, apparently. What do I have down here in the system? Yes. Right wing, one, two, three, four. Perfect. I don't need anybody defensively. One, two, three, four, five, six. Beautiful. Goalie wise, we are great. She's already a 78 after being signed. Alright, so I need one center, one left wing, and then whatever prospects I feel like grabbing to fill in the AHL roster, because there's not going to be anybody there. Uh, I just want to check in the system. What do I have for forwards? Just two, four, six, eight, nine, ten, nine. So I have nine forwards, I need at least three more. Defensively, I've got four, so I need at least two more. But some decent ones. Okay. Uh, right, so we need left wingers. Actually, I need a center first. Somebody who was actually decent last year. Alright, right, Dirk, step in. I realize I wouldn't have to go that far. Nobody's interested in you, but I will give you a little bit more money. I have 12 mil, so I'm more than okay here. Left wingers. Same kind of deal. I want to find somebody who is defensively responsible. I think mean, Connor Sherry's not a bad shout. So 
going to go a little bit cheaper. Cogs. Brandon Peary. Two teams are interested in Cogs at that price. I'm going to throw my hat in the ring for Cogs here. Give him one year. At two and a half. That's five of my 12. Perfect. Uh, so forward wise, let's go to two way. Let's go to overall. All right. Lad, that. We'll give Carson's Coolman's this. Uh, let's go. This one you're not back yet. Let's go. we got here I said I had nine and that was my three I'm just gonna grab a couple more uh, let's see anybody else that's fairly young here that I could snag Steenbergen let's go with this guy Bergman Let's go with Smith. For sure. And then we'll go down to defense and we'll grab like a couple here. Uh, Gwonky, we'll grab you in. And Chris. So we do Zach. Ruminin. And then if I can find one more guy like that. I mean the fact that Bodie Wild is here, we'll snake him. It's pretty good for us. You wouldn't have seen it, but I did a Islander series. Such a strong defensive core. I had the same, I did a Columbus series as well. I just started doing like NHL teams I hadn't played as and just seeing if I could make them better and won with both teams. Um, I think Columbus was an ish error because the game crashed and I lost the finals and then I went back and I won the finals. So, uh, but we won. So we'll take it. All right, I think we are good on that. Um, coaching wise, we just need a coach at the end of the year once we get the roster set up. All right, so we will advance a couple days here. Cogs comes in. We want a somewhat sizable Oh my goodness. He ch I thought he chose not to come with me. Oh, that fucking sucks. Oh, we better do fucking good next year. <laughs> Alright. Everybody that we wanted there signs. Beautiful. Let's sim to next season. And go through the rosters and then uh, we'll get set up for next year fantastic was not expecting that I really did not want to pay that either fuck well you make poor decisions sometimes wow I'm just blown away I didn't realize I should stop and read things a little bit more that's on me that's on me, fans. Sorry about that. But it's basically my fault.
and my roster. I'll make it work. All right, let's edit these lines. Oh yeah, it's been a while. Forgot how we did this now. Uh, go to roster moves. All right, NHL one forward. Well, actually, let's go centers. There's our four left wingers. One, two, three, four, five. Um, okay, so Cogs and Lad are going down. I want Forche to play. Yeah, that works for me. Right wingers, Kane, Castaway Blaze in the system. Logan Hutsko probably should play over half the way. Oh, man. No, he's young. Unless I go left wingers. Can't really do anything there. Uh, hold on a second. In the system. No, come on. Right wingers. Let's go play center. What's your center? Face offs is a 70. I mean, you suck at it. But if I bring, like, a Glenn Denning, to, oh, he's got 90 face offs, so step in. There. And then defensively, that gives us one, two, that's exactly what I want here. One, two, three, four, five, eight, perfect. Goalie-wise, she's a 79. That's what I didn't look at. Where are my boys at? Veneer's an 83, Holloway's an 82. Uh, Gunther's an 87. Defensively, 88 for Bockwest, 85 for Owen Power. And beautiful. So let's edit these lines. Every time. One day we'll figure it out. Head coach preferred. Beautiful. Okay, I like that. I like this. Gaby's got a 60 face off, though. I'd rather do that. I mean, I'd like to see Chanel play a little bit higher if he could. I don't hate that, actually. Chanel, Holloway, Bunting. That's going to be a tough line to play against. And then you've got... Okay, we're going to run that. We're on defense. We are going to run this. Alright, running that. Goalie-wise, we know. AHL, we are going to run. I did it again. Every time, folks. Without fail. Change something and I'll forget about it. Coglio, McBain, Kamel, Schnarr, Bergman. I just want to make sure anybody's sitting. I mean. The fact that Andrew Ladd is sitting is hilarious. But I love it. So it's not like there's really anybody that I'm missing. Everybody else is kind of like a medium nine, medium six. So not too concerned. Even strength wise, cogs.
Kishnar is, oh, well, he's a low 6 too. But Strongest is 21. Okay. Alright, we'll run it this way. Defensively. I mean, obviously looks good to me. So let's get out of here. Uh, set captains. So Ganther Power and Boquist. Uh, I am going to take the C off and give him an A. And just leave it as that. Be done. And then there was coaching. I'm not looking at it. You can look at it. There's nothing there. We just see names and countries and question marks. Um, okay, so sorry. We need to go to coaching staff quickly. So Madsen is a 52. Oops. So we'll put Luongo up here. We'll take a look at where he falls. 66. Okay. So, so far he is winning the roll. And Hayes gets an idea up here. 65. Okay. So those two are both going to be up there. That's for sure. NHL assistant. Well, I'm going to put Wilcox up there just to give him a shout. So I'm gonna put you back as AHL head coach. Longo's coming up. Hazy's coming up. Beautiful. And now I need a AHL coach. How are you over here, buddy? 62. I'll take it. I'm not gonna fuck around with that. Um, I need to find one more coach that's fairly decent. Uh, Ladder Tavares are kind of what I'm looking at going to go with Tavares. I'll give you the associate coach role, Tavares. And then what I will do is I will take Sinistin, Sinistin. To assistant. Next thing we need to do is scouts. And I still have more spots, eh? Well, whatever. So Russia, Liga, SHL, Ice, Extra Liga, and LLDLA. Q, O, so I need one in the O. One in Neo, one in Neo. Where do I put the other one usually? Hmm. First three, Henry, because you're going to go right there. Beautiful, and Yashin, I'm just going to take you as well. So you'll just go to leave the dub. Perfect. So that is that. Apparently I moved my mouse. And we are good to move forward. And sim to the regular season. Yashin comes. Tavara signs. Beautiful. Jack McBain for some picks. I mean, he is playing. Repkoff isn't. I mean, I have players to replace McBain. He's not huge for us. He is 23, though. I mean, a fourth next year. I did give up some picks. A seventh in the year after. I mean, these picks aren't as great as they would be, right? Because a fourth is pretty much a six at this point. Uh, I am going to decline this, even though I want the picks. I just don't think there's going to be much available to us down there. Uh, and we're going to start seeing that once the computer, fully computer-generated drafts go through. Uh, nope, I'm going to decline that as well. 
I'm also going to decline this offer. I'm not going to make any trades right now. We're going to go into the season and kind of see where we go. Obviously not going to give up Rodrigue. Uh, not going to give up McBain. I know, we have a log jam of talent, but that's fine. We're trying to grow it and then try and get the most for it. So we will do what we can. Oh my goodness. Everybody wants these players, but I think it's just my draft board. I think in the next round I am just going to take off trade. Yeah, I'm going to give up Janot. Really? I literally just took everything off, did I not? I have a pretty full depth chart anyway, so... I guess I should double check that. And I still have 12 million in cap. Beautiful. On September 29th, that's my birthday. Well, I've already done that. All right, folks, we've made it. It was a lengthy one, I feel, um, but we got a lot done. We got some pretty interesting players, Patrick Kane, that's for sure. Let's take a look at how we stack up this year. I didn't do it last year because I knew the team was going to be absolute garbage, but we can definitely take a look and see where we stand. We are a 88, a 90, and an 82 in goal. That is pretty good compared to an 89, 90. Uh, not too bad, actually. I'm pretty excited for this team. Uh, look forward to seeing what they can do in the next season. So thanks for coming out and hanging out with me tonight, folks. I will see you again very, very soon. Much love. Bye-bye.